All right, and time to take a look at what's been he making headlines in the world of sports now. Robert Kipkamboy and Naomi Jebet reigned supreme in the men's and women's full marathon, respectively, to be crowned the new champions of the Nairobi City Marathon. Kipkamboy toppled the 2022 winner, Drimin Misoy, who didn't make it to the podium as Jebet took advantage of the absence of defending champion Agnes Barsocio to clinch the top sport. Elvis Hillary and Akea followed the marathon on the streets of Nairobi and now brings us the day's highlights. Robert Kipkemboe is stormed off in the last six kilometers of the men's 42 kilometers race to stop the time at two hours, seven minutes and 38 seconds to be crowned the men's 2023 Nairobi City Marathon champion. 33-year-old Kipkemboe, who won the Eastern Bowl Marathon last year in a time of 2 hours, 10 minutes and 18 seconds, elbowed Charles Mneria and Robert Kipkorir into second and third places respectively. And the second edition of the Nairobi City Marathon. I think I found the be Stockholm, but it's a good man. I think I found the Kipkorir in Leo, and Leo is the one who is the one who is the one. Istanbul Marathon. Istanbul Marathon, eh? Yeah, I'm going to go to the Moja. So I'm going to go to the Moja. Yeah, I'm going to go to the Moja. I'm going to go to the Moja. So I'm going to go to the Moja. In the women's full marathon, Naomi Jebet secured the plaudits in coming from the chasing park to join the leading group before securing the win in 2 hours, 24 minutes and 33 seconds. Arusho Sharon Chelimu and Jerubeth Judith came in second and third. <laughs> The 21 kilometers was dictated by Uganda's Maxwell Rutich and Gladys Chepkurui, who won the men's and women's races. Peter Moniki and Brenda Tuwei triumphed in the 10 kilometers race. Yeah. Meanwhile, thousands of runners joined elite athletes for the fun races. Mental health. Uh, there's a way that sweating, hormonals moving around in your body shapes your mental health. And I think rather than just sit at home feeling cold, you might as well come here warm up. It works the entire body. So cities are the biggest pollutant in the world. And at least we are seeing that right now they are starting to take action. So I came here to join hands to communicate to the world that everyone should know about climate change. So as young people we must move. You know guys are getting unhealthy because you're not moving. So primarily that's my motivation for running. Please join, start slow, start slow, one, one step at a time and you'll see yourself somewhere. You don't have to win but you will have to do something to your body that is very essential and important. The full marathon winners received 3.5 million Kenyan shillings. The streets of Nairobi are closed down on very unique occasions, and one of those is the Nairobi City Marathon, an elite race that depicts Kenya's athletic spirit. Hilary Aneke, NTV Sports, Nairobi. And the junior